hey guys welcome back to my channel nello here with a very beautiful face you guys already know okay guys this is moving week for me by the time i send this video i probably have moved i'm going to be updating you guys in this video but before we get to the updates i'm going to be showing you guys this week from rpg show see once i show you this week you're going to be like of course nello you're going to love this week this week is from rpg show i'm so excited if you know me start commenting what's my favorite texture what's my favorite wig texture if you know me you should know this answer it's too easy Anyways, it comes in this box, this packaging. It comes with this RPG show. Fun fact, I already brought out the one I'll use for today. This is from RPG show as well. But basically, it comes with it for you to help secure your wig. It also comes with a wig cap. And finally, it comes with this bag that has like a scissors, tweezer, um, blade to like cut your lace off and um, a brush okay so it comes with this bag i hope this is focusing because somehow my monitor is messing up today so i'm actually not seeing myself on my monitor i hope i'm in focus please god okay so i'm just going to read out some of the specs so this is a yaki the texture is yaki it is 12 inches it's natural color and my cap size is size 2 which is 22.5 to 23 inches um, circumference that's my cap size and this wig is a 13 by 6 glueless lace front wig okay with transparent swiss lace tinted transparent swiss lace so this is the wig straight out of the box i love the texture of this wig so this is the wig straight out of the box i hope you guys can see this um so this is yaki texture and this is a yaki straight and the good thing about yaki is that you can coil it you can wear it straight like it, it holds coils really well and this is a 13 by 6 like i already mentioned again all the details will be in my description you guys already know rpg show okay the lace is coming tinted it's already tinted and this is a transparent swiss lace it's very thin and of course you guys already know that rpg is not going to send out your wig without tweezing it so it's already pre-plucked they already plucked it i said tweezing plucking um it came pre-plucked they already plucked it i hope you guys are seeing it well but it came pre-plucked and it's center part and i'm going to wear a center part today and y'all i'm not going to do anything to this wig like i'm not going to pluck it anymore i'm not going to do anything i'm going to wear it straight out of the box and i'm not going to be using any glue whatsoever just minimal spray that's what i'm going to use to put this wig on because you guys know we like easy wigs like we don't like wigs that we'll have to do too much to anyways you guys remember to check out all the details they'll be in my description without talking too much let me just put this wig on my head okay Okay, you guys, I'm done laying the wig. I hope that I don't encounter any problem because I didn't let this uh, spray dry before tying this down. But anyways, you guys, we are moving. I'm going to be straightening this hair. Like, I'm going to wear it completely straight. Like, I'm just going to straighten it to make it look silky straight. Like, I straightened my natural hair. I'm just using this to press it down a little bit. You guys, we are moving. We have been living in this same house for eight to nine years i keep saying eight to nine years because every time i kind of need to calculate to actually know the exact amount of time it's really such a bittersweet moment for me because <sighs> it's been home for me for let's just say eight years let's just go with the um lower one because oh yeah i think it's eight years actually not nine years i think it's eight years because kobe is eight and we moved in here immediately um kobe was born 
So it's a bittersweet thing for me because, of course, um, you know, I'm happy for change. Um, change is good and change is the only constant thing in life, really. So I'm happy about that. But at the same time, it's been home for a long time. So it's almost like, oh, I want to go, but I'll miss you. <laughs> Do you guys ever get that feeling? Even though at this point, I'm really fed up. Like, I'm really fed up. Because we've been planning on kind of moving, right? We were not sure, but like, it was a conversation we had. I've not really been doing much in this house. You guys, can you see this hair? Like, can you see how good this hair is taking this heat? Anyways, because we've been planning on kind of moving, I'm not going to lie, I stopped taking care of the house. Like, if anything spoils, I'm like, okay, but we want to move, so... What's the point of repairing it so because of that the house just took a deep dive so at the same time as much as i'll miss the home the house that i've called home you know for this past eight years um i'm also happy to leave it because things are upside down <laughs> literally like everything is turning upside down and i just can't wait to move do you guys get that feeling it's your name it's almost like i want to move but gosh I know it's going to be stressful. I don't want to move, but I want to move. That's exactly how I'm feeling now. But the kids, on the other hand, overexcitement is killing them. Like, when I mean overexcitement, they can't wait to go. This is the only home they've known as well. This is our second home as, um, you know, husband and wife. We lived in a two-bedroom apartment before we moved into this three-bedroom apartment. And now we're moving out. So, um, for us, it's going to be our third home. But this is the first time the kids are actually moving and it's just exciting them they just like new things different things like as long as it's not the old one they are used to they're happy you guys so as i'm coiling this hair i'm not even like i'm packing hair on do you get what i mean i'm not even doing it small small and it's taking coils like a boss like do you, i don't have to explain what i'm trying to say you know normally there are some wigs that or some hair textures that when you pack plenty it's not going to coil this one, I'm actually packing enough and it's coiling really, really well. I don't know if I should make it have a bob. Okay, maybe I should make it have a bob. <laughs> because I like bobs, let me just bob it. Slightly, ever so slightly, like, ever so slightly. Can you guys see that? It's so subtle. It's not like the very coily one. When it comes to yaki textures, RPG should, hands down, have the best yaki texture that I've used. Um, there's just something about their yaki straight that I love. Did you guys see how easy that was? Like, that was too easy. Straightening this hair or bobbing this hair was just too easy. This wig is so silky. Can you guys see? Like, it's, <laughs> it's so silky. Wait, it's not silky text. It's not a silk textured wig, right? Or it's not silky per se. But it feels very smooth and very light. That's what I'm saying, it's silky. It's not silky, it's yaki. But it feels very smooth and very light and very, very easy to work with. It's gorgeous, like... <laughs> Of course, it's gorgeous. Okay, you guys, so I'm going to go ahead and get my makeup done, come back. I'm going to remove this band and just come back with a band, okay? So let us go ahead and transform in three, two, one. She be the hottest in town, coming out the twilight lit. Yeah, let them know who got the crown. Girl, who does it like you do? Always keep it hondo when you move. You don't really want it with her crew. Yeah. Don't need that drama, she calling your mama. Ooh. So guys, this is the finished look and your girl is here feeling herself, okay? I love, love this wig. So I love bob wigs and I love yaki wigs. So imagine a wig that has two of my favorite things. Absolutely gorgeous, I love it. And this lace, let me tell you guys, this tinted transparent Swiss lace is, is gorgeous, okay? It's barely detectable. Like, I know sometimes I will come and say, can you see the lace? I see some comments like, yes, we can, of course. We're wearing a wig, but when we ask that question, we mean that the lace is so good that it's actually difficult to see. And mind you, cameras are not forgiving sometimes. They show everything. In person, you can barely tell I'm wearing a wig. I'm sure this is one of those wigs that when I go out, I'm, when I go out, people will be like, oh, your hair is so nice, your hair is so long, because it looks like my hair was straightened. Anyways, this lace is gorgeous. And mind you, I didn't use any glue. Imagine if I actually use a glue to lay this wig down. I didn't use any glue, like it's, it's um, glueless. So I can basically pull it up. You guys can see. Like, you can pull it up and put it back down. You can see completely glueless. Um, sometimes when I spray this glue, I don't spray it enough to hold it down for long, okay? I just want it to kind of have a flat look in front. That's why I spray the glue. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget all the details you need, all the discount, whatever you need, is going to be in my description box down below. So do check it out. Like, can you guys see this wig? Can you see me? <laughs> 
I think I'm done talking because I feel like my face, my hair, everything is doing all the talking for me. So I'll catch you guys in my next video. Don't forget to check out my description for all the details you need. Bye, guys.